friends welcome to my workplace at ranaghat west bengal india this is a posterior subcapsular cataract with a very soft nucleus let us observe this surgery this is the main incision with a 2.8 mm steel keratom on the posterior aspect of the limbus and now the anterior chamber is filled up with 2% hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose then a side port is made on the left side of the main incision about 3 clock hours away now capsular axis is to be done i am using a utrita forceps piercing the anterior capsule at the center raising a tag guiding this capsular tag all around and getting and an adequate size to axis of about 5.5 millimeter now hydro dissection and hydro delineation this is 27 case cannula and BSS So visco is expressed out this is hydro dissection and this is hydro delineation hydro delineation has produced a beautiful golden ring in this case antechamber is again filled off with visco and now we are going to see the carousel technique in this case The tip of the FECO needle is introduced with its bevel down, that is towards the lens mass. Some superficial cortical lens matter is removed. The nucleus is rotated nicely. For carousel technique, the nucleus should rotate freely. And now watch the carousel technique place the teeth at the edge of the nuclear mass remove the chopper and carousel the nucleus it is done the epinucleus follows so the carousel technique is fast prerequisite is the nucleus should rotate very nicely hydro delineation should be done and the nucleus should be soft and now cortical cleanup is to be done I'm going to use a 23 gauge Simcoe cannula for removal of the cortex so most of the cortical matter has come out by this time the sub incisional cortex is being removed and going through the side port in this case we have only one side port which is about 1.8 millimeter in size and three clock hours away from the main incision when the side port is 90 degree away from the main incision and if it is a bit wider then the astigmatism induced by the main incision may be neutralized to some extent by the side port and now hydro implantation of a single piece monofocal intraocular lens and this lens opened very abruptly the material is it is said hydrophilic acrylic but it is opening very abruptly the lens is in the bag
and we are towards the end of the surgery. I inject a bit of moxifloxacin at this time and then I close the sideboard by corneal stromal hydration. The main wound is constructed in such a way that it will not require any hydration This is the final lavage of the interior chamber. The antechamber is nicely formed and the case is concluded. The integrity of all the wounds are checked, both the main wound and the side port. and the case is concluded. Let us see the carousel technique in slow motion. This is 50% speed. Rotate the nucleus. It should rotate very freely. Remove some superficial cortical lens matter. And now Place the needle sideways facing the nuclear mass. Place it in this way and start using the vacuum and power. I am using 400 vacuum and 40 fluoride. And the nuclear mass rotates and gets removed. So this is the carousel technique in slow motion. The epinucleus is removed. The epinucleus is mobile so it is coming to the teeth very easily. So the key is nuclear rotation. The rotation should be good and the carousel technique becomes very easy and safe. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will inspire you to try this technique in soft cataracts.